Hey, what's up, guys? It's Brain PCC, and welcome back to another Rise of Civilization video. And in today's video, we are going to be talking about uh, the best Archer duo, or like the best Archer only unit duo. So, like, if you were using Archer's only unit, so you could get the best reward, the best bonuses from the Archer commanders, then these are the kind of duos that would be the best. Now, this would be in my opinion, and everybody might not agree with me. But I would say that these are the best duos, so I would probably say that, um, I, uh, so, without a doubt, I would definitely say that Yi Yi is the best archer-only commander in the game because of this one skill of a, a archer attack bonus of 100% when maxed out. Now, this is way better than any of the other archer commanders in the game. So this is without a doubt he's going to be in the best duo without without anybody arguing that. So the, the discussion is who is the second best. So I'm going to be talking about who is the second best. There are a couple other archer commanders. Um, I know Kusunoki is one. Um, I, I know that Markswoman is, but I already talked about how she's terrible. Um, and El Cid, I know he is, and I think there's a few others, I just can't remember right now. But, the controversy could be that people would say that El Cid would be the second best, but I would probably say that he's not. Just because, in his skill that makes him an archer commander, it's archer defense by 20%, now that's pretty good, and archer march speed by 15%. Now you want to be using um, archers for uh, march speed bonuses, because they're because cavalry is way fast isn't way faster but they're faster than archers so they're probably not the best to use be, uh, for like speed i mean like if you're an archer of osiris and you're using archer only units they can be useful but it's not pro primarily something that you'd be using all the time so um i wouldn't say that this the speed isn't that much um but um kutunoki has a way better skills for archers. Now, this is in my opinion. I wouldn't. I'm not. Con, I'm not saying completely because he has um, archer attack bonus by 10 percent and archer defense bonus by 10 percent. Now, with expertise, this is what makes it a lot more me more sure that it, he is better is because he has archer attack by 50 percent and archer defense by 15 percent. Those would add an extra five percent to you at attack and defense. So, um, this would just give some, um, this would give better buffs, rather than, um, El Cid, who has, um, own defense of 20%, and altogether, um, Kusunoki has, um, a bonus of 30%, including defense and attack, and he only has 20%, now like I said, I wouldn't count March speed that good, because it's not really that important. And he doesn't have any other archer skills, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's... wait, what? Uh... March speed bonus by 25%. This wouldn't be good, also. Um, increases... Um, well, this is one other, but it increases damage dealt to infantry units by archer units. And decreases damage taken, so this would be if you're attacking infantry troops. But I'm pretty sure in Archer's counter. Oh, yeah, they do counter infantry, but um, it's still. If you're using Archer units against an entire mixed army, this wouldn't be as useful as attacking an entire unit. And like I said, he only has. Um, uh, this is another defense for um, Archers. And. It's still not something that would be commonly used, so I would still stand by that Kusunoki is a better archer only commander. So, right now, because I don't have um, Yisung Nida 3 stars yet, I, I usually use Kusunoki as primarily commander and have some of his talents for um, archers and the rest for skill. And then uh, Yisung Yi as my um, backup because he has 60% where I have him at right now. Now, uh, this if you guys have any suggestions for if you guys would disagree that El Cid would be better, then please tell me in the comments below because I want to know um, your guys' um, 
opinions on it because this is something that's pretty controversial. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys do like Rise of Civilizations. And also, um, I'll be making um, Daily Rise of Civilization videos here. So uh, if you like um, Daily Tips for Rise of Civilizations, then please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.